Hey dudes, it's Pixel Tricks. Welcome to some Elite Smash today with Daisy. We actually get into Elite Smash like uh, pretty far into the video, like 10 15 minutes in. Yeah, I guess that means there's a lot of uh, Daisy players you can see all over Taunt right here. So, back in my Smash 4 days, there was a point where I was like, I want to main Peach because this character looks so cool when played correctly with all of their very impressive like movement options. And I tried for the longest time to get some of their more technical stuff down, but I just fell out of practice because, you know, like in Smash 4, I was making so many videos of so many characters. And I think the Peach engine uh, takes a lot of dedication to really master. It's a very technical character, like, like I was saying, but. All right, so Daisy. Daisy is pretty much Speedy Peach. Uh, the, you don't have as much power, but yeah, you're a little faster, so take that for what you will. Other than that, I, I really don't see any differences. But then again, I haven't uh, played Peach at all, so. Yeah, pretty familiar to me since I uh, try to get good at this character. They still retain their down throw combos. You you want to like down tilt, or down throw a low percent, and follow it up with a forward tilt in the opposite direction, yeah. Turns are really good in this game because uh, you can't just air dodge them. I know I say that about so many themes, and I'm getting pretty repetitive at this point, but uh, it's pretty cool they added Toad in to their grab animations like that. And Daisy gets a blue Toad. I'm assuming Peach gets like just the normal Toad. It's pretty cool. They actually made it so you can control what comes out of your F Smash depending on what direction that you face. Or, what direction you tilt the control stick, so... I'll actually be showcasing that a little bit later here today. Okay, so I think this character is going to be extremely strong in this game, because they have... A lot of the things in Smash 4 that made them so good, they've retained their grab game. They have amazing edge guarding uh, tools. They're, they're pretty speedy. And, and their moves like link into each other pretty well. Like you'll you get like a throw out a fair combo into dash. Dash is a an amazing follow up tool in uh in this game, which I always really like. It, it's been a while since I, I played Peach, so <laughs> I ended up uh, dropping a lot of my combos here. Is this a CPU? They're actually edge guarding now, so I think it's a CPU. <laughs> they actually made it. In the first patch, they made it so when you unlock characters, they won't be, like, hard. They won't be level 9 now, I guess, so... <laughs> Funny enough. Um, I guess people were getting bopped by the computers, so they had to tone them down. Yeah. I was out here day one, so I had to fight... I had to f fight those monsters myself. Yeah. Yeah, you know, Fair is still very strong. Apparently, they nerfed down there, so it doesn't link into itself anymore, which is very unfortunate. Because that was amazing, like, combo starter in Smash 4. Was, uh, you could, like, down air, link it into another down air, and then hit him with a fair. But I, I guess that doesn't work anymore. I, I can't really confirm it. It's just what I heard. So I didn't throw out any, like, uh, float cancel down air today. Yeah, that's another thing. The recovery just goes so far. And, and you have mix-up options with the float, with the double jump. Then you can air dodge. Oh wow, that combo, that was gonna get. It was a little cute. I'm pretty sure it's a computer, because they're... Uh, I don't know. Yeah, no, that's a computer. There's no way a person would detect that. <laughs> and gotten into like a medium back air, dude. That's super funny. Yeah, you can uh, Z-drop your turnips. And it becomes just such a problem for people to deal with online. Certainly, I, I, I certainly have been sniped by quite a few turnips so far. Right here I can uh, show off some of Daisy's alt costumes. Of course she has the peach outfit. I like this one, the black and green. My uh, two favorite colors. As you would probably guess from, you know, my intros and stuff like that. Yeah. 
people are actually asking me um, what my intro sound effect is from. It's from Metal Gear Solid 3. It's when you uh, bring up the sub menu for like your items. The game is a masterpiece. I, I want to play it in order. I want to play uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 before I get to the third one. But Metal Gear Solid 3 is so good. I haven't played 2 though, so I don't know. Alright, so we actually ran into a King K. Rule player. That was actually Impidere. Yeah, Neutral B is still a counter with Toad. You know, that's something I never, ever use with, uh, with Peach or Daisy here, is their, uh, is their counter. I, I don't know. I don't know why either. I just never feel inclined to throw it out. And it is useful because a lot of the time, um, You'll be like floating in the air trying to catch people with fairs and stuff, so people instinctively want to like jump up and hit you, so you can throw it out. But yeah, it's just not a tool I take advantage of uh, very often myself. Then again, not like the most experienced player. Obviously, as you can see, I'm playing a pretty standard game. It's been a while since I played this engine, this type of character. So, so down throw to uh, oh, yeah, you down throw back air, but at early percent, you want to down throw forward tilt. Oh wow, nice roll of breed from my opponent right here. Lemon Jesus. No. <laughs> dude, this on is a baner, dude. Listen to that baseline. Wow. But yeah, I like mid percents, you down throw and get a, a free back air out of it. And that in itself is just so good. That creates so much pressure. With their toolkit to be able to throw out an air so fast to hit you with that extremely powerful forward air it, it just creates a very threatening character This person was very smart. That's mr. Saturn if you try to shield mr. Saturn uh, it breaks your shield so Yeah, I was trying to steal mr. Saturn again I like that DC has um all these cool little effects when she lands her moves. This guy seemed pretty good. He had some uh, pretty nice movement. Yeah, you can apply safe pressure on shield too, like because uh, you can auto cancel your back airs and follow it up with a forward tilt, as you just saw. So down throw forward tilt. See, just like that, a low percent. Okay, so I actually learned about King K. Rool's uh, down throw. You want to start mashing as soon as he grabs you, and you don't want to stop. So, like, while he's in the animation of throwing you into the ground, you want to be mashing then. Like, you, as soon as they grab you, just keep mashing, and you'll get out faster. Something I learned. Yeah. Similar to Rob. Oh, claps. Those King K. claps, dudes. Apparently side B kills. I did not throw it out a lot today. I never like throwing out side B because it's very punishable, but it's, it's apparently a very good uh, kill move. And look at this. You can Z drop turnips to edge guard now on King King Rule. So they actually have a tool to edge guard that, that recovery that's so good. That like so many characters have a hard time getting past, right? So that in itself is phenomenal for the character. Just being able to Z-drop turnips and actually snipe King K rules at B is, is really good. Yeah. Yeah, man. I remember when the Smash Ballads came out. And uh, there was a bunch of people very excited for the idea of having Daisy. There was actually like full Twitter accounts dedicated to Daisy for Smash. And a lot of Daisy fans... And, uh, I'm happy to see that they actually got in. Um, I'm sure a lot of people were very happy. No, oh, wow. Uh, ducking right under the uh, <laughs> the crown right there. 
Yeah, I didn't throw out a lot of float cancels today. To be perfectly honest, I was playing a pretty uh, defensive game. A lot of turnips, a lot of uh, like mix of dashes. But yeah, you can see the float cancel. Um, yeah, look at look how good this is. Look, that's so good, dude. Wow. I normally have a very hard time edge guarding this character, so. That's gonna make it so King K doesn't get back for free all the time now. Now yeah, off stage. I managed to drop some bear. And unfortunately my opponent uh, missed their attack. I, I like their up air attempt though. I saw what they were going for. Nice 11. Extra credit. Let's see. At this point I can trade projectiles. Oh, uh, okay. I like the tech roll in mix up. You know, on heavy characters, you can still connect your, uh, ooh, nice back air right there. You can still connect your down throw forward tilt. Yeah. I, I really wish I did throw out the down air more often so I could actually showcase it. Because I'm not entirely sure if it is as bad as I think it is. I can already tell, though, the hitbox is definitely different. Watch the flow of my movements as I demonstrate. Chip. Getting all the turnip chip right here. Nice 100 extra credit right here. Very good angle with our up B. Yeah, see, I was completely... I was camping this guy with the turnips, bro. Oh, nice fair. Okay. Now return to your original position. I like this guy's like back air placement actually. Yeah, it's very good. Oh, that's a dot eyes. Oh, I dropped it though. Yeah, dot eyes has a uh, uh, like increased knockback. So the turnips all have like different properties. That's a dot eyes that will kill. Yeah, see, it's very strong. Yeah, so you can randomly pick up stuff like Mr. Saturn, the dot eyes. You can pick up bombs. I don't know if they have the saber in this game. I don't know if they actually added anything new, to be perfectly honest. That'd be kind of cool if they gave, like, new stuff for, uh, for Daisy. Oh, that was kind of cute. Up air is a great move for shark and platforms, too. Nice multi-hidden move. Like, hit someone's shield, it could be a nice little mix-up. And I don't feel like it's a multi-hidden move that people fall out of either, so... But, yeah, they have the uh, privilege of... Being able to mix up the recovery, as as you're seeing right here, with like the double jumps, the the stalls, the float stalls, right? But of course, if you're very high percent, no matter how much you mash, you're gonna die regardless. So this guy seemed pretty cool. He had a lot of like really oh oops, sorry for a little uh video error right there. My capture is ancient, dude. Keep your hands and heels on the floor. Oh, claps. Oh, still alive? Very surprised. Almost had to dash. Now, return to your original position. Yeah, he's trying to mix me up with um his like back and forth dash, but it just gives me free setup for more turnips. I managed to get the drops. Uh, I like the the freeze frame of that because she's like winking while she <laughs> while she hits you. I love this victory screen too. It's very like elegant. I want to say. All right, so I believe yeah, we get an elite smash right here. Some long fights. Yeah, I got had some really good movement. I will say. This one just saying, I think this character is gonna be very good in this game. With the right amount of de dedication. Like every time I used to run into like a, a Peach main, I would be afraid. Because they they just They're just intimidating characters. They really are to me. Yeah. Alright, so we actually ran into a uh, Captain Falcon player here. 
I've been hearing mixed things about Falcon. Some people who say, uh, he's still very good. Other people hate his new tools. I mean, he has the same moveset, but a lot of things are different. I guess his grab game isn't as good either. What's his sign? I, I snapped his jump with the fair. He died. That was so dirty, dude. Wow. Oh, I dropped way too low. Oh, if I got, like, the fox drag down, that would have been so hype. <laughs> now, what song is this? What game is this from? Oh, terrible space on my back right there. A free shield grabbed my life and I dropped it. I think I wasn't too much done, actually. Yeah, I feel like shield stun is pretty gnarly in this game, honestly. Oh, nice nair. Okay, front throw. Yeah, Falcon Kick actually kills now. There's much more knockback. Oh wow, nice back air. Snap me right out of my uh, float right there. Yeah, that's what you gotta watch out for. These people just snapping you out of the air though, so. These are more like aggressive characters. Why are they playing with two stocks? It's such a short game. Oh, he took his one, <laughs> he took his one win and he was like, nah, no more. <laughs> so if you actually lose enough in Elite Smash, apparently you get kicked out of it. I guess I'm still in it. I guess I didn't lose enough points. But yeah, you'll be kicked back to, uh, I think, what's it called? Solo Battles? Yeah, so... Getting into Elite Smash isn't enough. You still... You have to, like, maintain your score. It makes sense. I wonder if you decay in this game, like... If you don't play the character enough, it, you, you'll just automatically be booted out of it. I would assume so, huh? I haven't seen any of my characters that have made into Elite Smash not be in it yet. Daisy's just so happy to be in Smash. Yeah, I never really played any of the games that Daisy has been in previously. I played like a couple Mario parties, right? I guess. Not a lot of the recent ones. I've heard very bad things. Apparently the new one is really good though. I think I might get the new Mario Party. Yeah, I think I'm going to get the new Mario Party and play it alone with the computers because I have no friends. <laughs> and I think I'll make videos on it and like get drunk again. Because I made a couple Mario Party. I, I made a couple of videos. Yeah, Lonely Boy plays Mario Party alone and gets drunk and sad <laughs> and loses to Luigi a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Those videos were so fun to make, though. Dude, I haven't just sat down and got trashed in so long. That's a lot of bombs. <laughs> okay, so this is Daisy's final smash. She puts your opponent to sleep, gets rid of all the items on the field, and summons Daisy's, which heal her, and you get a free punish on your opponent. So, it's one of the best for... It's probably the best final smash in the game. Like, that right there is why we don't use meter, unfortunately. Because the lack of balancing, because that's so good. And you get ones that are so bad, like Jigglypuffs, Ice Climbers isn't too good. Yeah, it's just a very unbalanced mechanic of the game. And it sucks, because the meter is such a sick idea, and would add so much to the game if they just balanced it out. If they just gave everyone a fair final smash, and I feel like it's a huge missed opportunity yeah oh it's a fake one. Oh, it got me it got me yeah i would not be opposed to supers at all all right so we actually run into roy player roy i feel like this matchup hev heavily benefits roy because he is so fast you just rush in on a the Peach Engine and, um, like, snipe him out of the air. 
with uh, his very good aerials. I feel like Roy is low-key broken in this game. Like, he's really- he goes to 80 with said D <laughs> at the ledge. On a lot of characters, so. Down smash out of shield, huh? Yeah, you can float for a decent amount of time, about like two two fairs worth of time. I want to say. So, it's useful. Oh wow, nice forward tilt right there. All right, let's. Yeah, he jumped, man. I didn't capitalize. I saw the jump come from a mile away, dude. Like now, at least. Okay. Nice cross up on my shield with the nair, so he didn't get grabbed. I'm trying to get, get it back through you. Um, dead. Yeah? See? They become so good in this game. Like, so good. Just projectiles as a whole, I feel, got buffed pretty well. Yeah, you, so you can play, like, defensive with this character. I think you just mix it up with the dash. And dash is a great move for doing just that. So, yeah, see, like, this guy's trying to dash back and forth, catch me doing something dumb. And then randomly I'll just like come in and dash attack him. But just don't do it too much. Use it for punishing whipped attacks like that. Yeah, he's jumping out of hits down a lot. I notice. Yeah, I wasn't too f I was fast enough. I like that dash back. He has no jump. He's dead, yeah. <laughs> the Italian sniper strikes again. The Italian Irish. <laughs> I'm a mutt. I'm also German. <laughs> this on, dude. What iconic on, huh? Oh, nice. Uh, check a play street. He was a little off though. But yeah, Roy can. Uh, he wasn't thrown outside B enough. This player. Yeah. Oh look, you can see King DDD in the background, dude. See. That used to be a very rare occurrence in, uh... No, <laughs> I was trolling a little bit with up smashes. In, a, in melee, actually. It used to be a very rare thing to see King DDD. Nice roller breed, though. Yeah. He was trying to adapt here. I was a down throw, probably get a back air. Yeah, still linking in at, like, what What was that, 70? It's pretty good. I was trying to back throw him into the turn. I thought it'd be cute. Probably down smash at an instinct. Yeah, nice grab. He was reading my roll-ups. I gotta stop rolling up so much. Get my uh, turn-ups. Yeah, and Roy's moves just combo into each other. Like, they complement each other so well. As you can see, he, he hit me with the fair, and then he linked in so easy with the nair. Like, this character is busted in this game, I feel. If it weren't for his recovery, which is exploitable. I, I will say that. Yeah. But it's not the worst in the game. It's definitely not the worst, but it, it is a little underwhelming. Oh, let me stretch it off. <laughs> nice. But yeah, I had fun. I always like playing Peach, so. And I'm more so just happy for people who really wanted this character because I saw so much people putting in so much work. Like, trying to get people to vote for this character. And it's a real shame, because so many people made a joke of this Smash Ballot. And I thought it was such a cool idea uh, that Nintendo did. To actually ask you, hey, who do you want in the game? We'll, we'll do what we can do. And then so many people just wrote in stupid jokes and made a bunch of memes out of the thing. I, they should have had some kind of verification process. So you could only vote once, like once per email. But you could just go and do it whenever, so I don't feel like they handled it too well, to be perfectly honest. I like the music from the Ice Climber stage. This isn't Ice Climbers, but they have Ice Climber music here sometimes. Or at least they used to. I think this is from Ice Climber, I don't know, I didn't see. Um... Man, I played the NES Ice Climbers game, and it's so bad. <laughs> it's so terrible, dog. I was just a little bit off. You know what? I noticed I didn't throw out enough nares.
today. It comes out so fast. It's a really good move. I should have been throwing out many more Nairs. Probably down smash out of instinct. I noticed I do that a lot in high pressure situations. That's a stitch, baby. I was trying to get a, um, I missed my recatch, unfortunately. But yeah, you can still pull, pull stitches with uh, Daisy, so. I think I get a one of each today, so yeah, I'm happy I can showcase that. Right, we got Dot Eyes, we got Stitches, we got Mr. Saturn. All the good stuff. Got pretty lucky I was able to showcase all this today. I was chucking these turnips, dude. Oh, nice bear. Probably gonna... Ooh, okay. I like that he sharked his jump with that bear right there. That was cool. I bet up smash goes through the platform. I was, I was intent on getting that up smash. I ate so much damage because of it. It worked though. Down throw forward tilt. Probably the up air, yeah, I like it. I should have short hopped though, it would have hit him. You know, see up tilt uh, hits by the platforms too, it's pretty cool. Nice falling up air. Wow. Don't want to roll up, man. Yeah, that's a free dash. You just go back and forth. I have another stitch. Man, I dropped it though. No, I should have threw out a fair, for sure. A, ni a nice roll read right there from my opponent. Yeah, dash kills with Roy too. He was playing very defensive this game too. God, that was like his first side B. That he, he threw out this whole time. Now he's starting to throw it out. See, it's just dumb, easy free damage. I mean, if he's just gonna sit back and throw out aerials, I could just pull turnips. Trying to catch a landing with the up smash, right? Okay, probably front throw, get him off stage. All right, and I got him with the drop zone fair. Trying to get that easy forward tilt. Uh, that could have been probably a forward tilt shield for me. Yeah, extremely like defensive right here. Just throwing out tilts, not approaching at all. It's smart. It's hard to get past. And if one of those tilts connect, I just die. So. Yeah, see, that would have killed me if he hit it. He's not punishing my neutral getups at all. See, he, he was staying back this whole time and just gave me free reign to throw turnips and get jet for free. I'm being aggressive, dude. I really shouldn't be at this percent. Yeah, front throw. Ooh, if I got it, dude, he was dead. Oh, dude, I'm pulling it back, bro. Yeah, he was playing way too defensively. He had such a high lead, and now he just started bleeding percent. Okay. You see, if that hit me, I died. Absolutely, anywhere on the stage. Shield starting to get a little low. Oh, yeah, that's what he gets for running. That's what he gets. I get a free bomb. Wow. <laughs> well, that fight came to an explosive ending. <laughs> I'm here all. 
I'm here all week, folks. Please don't, please don't make me leave. I have nowhere to go. People are looking for me. <laughs> Specifically that guy. <laughs> wow. Well, yeah, and as you can see, she can still pull the bomb bombs. So, pretty happy I could show that off. <laughs> Clutch Keen, dude. Clutch Queen. Daisy the Clutch Queen, bro. Look how smug this girl is. Pretty funny. I made a long Daisy video. Yeah, I, did. I was having fun. I like this character. They're cool. So, hope you guys enjoyed. But yeah, right here you can see, you see how the items are changing in her hand? It's because I'm switching the direction that I'm tilting my smash attacks at. So, yeah. Could be either a tennis racket, a golf club, or a frying pan. Depending on what direction, what direction they are, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, drop zone fair, boys. Hold that 18. 18.9. Oh, nice follow-up. I like Fox's new fair in this game. I've been seeing people get results with this character, dude. People are saying he sucks. He, he looks just as good. Like, dude, if you have Nair to up smash and you have Fox's movement, there's no way there's going to be a bad character there. Like, yeah, it sucks about his side B, but I mean... Like, he got the Bayo treatment in that department. What a follow-up. Trying to get a grab. Trying to throw him off stage. Is he fucked? Oh, uh, running right past the back air pressure. Right ah, <laughs> that was funny. Back throw. Probably dead. Yeah, because the fox is a uh, fast falling speed right there. Right. Probably fast fall down. Right. Some I often find myself doing to forward tilt. Oh, it landed on the platform actually. What's he doing? He, that man just tried to shine spike me? That was so dangerous. <laughs> I like it though, it would've been cool. Pretty greedy up smash should just got a guaranteed punish. Cause I'm I'm rocking the extra credit right now, so it doesn't matter. Ooh, that combo, that was sick. That was so sick. I like it. Man just snipe his landing with the up smash right there. Okay, nice back air right there. Okay. Hit him with the sl They call her slaps, by the way. Oh my god, the claims, dude. DBZ. Dude, covering these landings with these up air, I like it. Look at that. Anti airs. Yeah, I'm tr I was trying to air through. I ate so much percent because of it. Like, Nair is a pretty decent combo breaker, actually. I just didn't have it come out in time. I like my jump. Oh, wow. I'm still alive. I still got my float. Ooh, let's see if I... Oh, yeah. I was trying to, I was trying to snap his recovery. Right. Okay, I'll go now. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> Or so, up there. Oh, bad trade. Oh, snipes. Nice roll in. Nice mix up. That would do it. Alright, dude. So, hope you enjoy it. And I will uh, see you on whatever we do next. So, I guess let me know what you would like to see. Alright, peace, dudes.